Uh, this will be a somewhat challenging uh, class to teach, but it's also something that experientially we can't do any other way. This is a very, very precise sensor on the end here. It measures the amount of dissolved oxygen in the water. There are eddies that spin only in that bottom couple of meters near the seafloor. And these eddies cause a rapid overturn of the water. And this has some implications for uh, corals themselves. You can see how that dye is dissipating. And it's spinning up in little eddies. This is Captain Phil Renault, the Executive Director of the Living Oceans Foundation. Welcome. The Aquarius underwater habitat has been in the water for approximately 10 years, so it has actually become part of the reef itself. Now here's an example of a omnivore. See, he's biting my finger. He's saying, please stay away from my eggs. I'm going to come eat your eggs here, buddy. attempt something that hadn't been done before, and that's uh, controlling a free-swimming robot over the internet. Yeah, we've had a whole team of graduate students helping us on this mission, and these, these people have been vital for the mission. It's so new and it's so cutting edge that everything that you do is, is brand new. We are showing a little piece of the ocean to the general public and to let them know this is our treasure and we need to work on it and save it.